Hey, what's up everybody? This is your friend Aki! Alright, so today's video is gonna be all about longi, guys. I'm gonna be, you know, teaching you guys how to wear longi and giving you guys some advice and some precautions when wearing it. Alright, so let's get into it, guys! This is longi, man. This is longi. So, you know, if you're a Burmese and watching this video, obviously, you know, you guys know more about longi than me. So, if I'm like giving out misinformation, correct me, okay? On the comment section. Alright, so yeah. So, this is longi and when it's brand new, it's folded like this. But this is not brand new. I've been using it for a while now. It can be bought for like, I don't know, 5, 10 bucks at anywhere, you know, like supermarket, anywhere. Yep, so yeah, that's longi. And let me open this thing up, okay? Spread it out. And it's like this. It's like, uh, you know, it's like a fucking tube here, you know? You can wear it here. And first, let me show you how to wear them. It can be a little bit difficult, but once you get used to it, it's not that difficult. So this is what it looks like and uh, on the outside there's actually a tag like this, like a brand tag and I am not too sure about this but I was told that this tag is supposed to be you know, facing out when you wear it and also should be on the bottom side of it. So this tag here, this tag here, I'm gonna wear it on the bottom side, okay? So what you gotta do is you go inside the longi and I like to have my tag here in the front area and what you gotta do is here this is where it becomes difficult actually this is the most difficult part uh, you fold it in like you give you put your arms like this and fold like you know one third of the you know the kilt like this and after you're done with that you'll be you're like this then you use you hold the longi here with your arm here like that and then you want to fold the left side like one third to like this and this is how we should look you know this is like one of the most important steps to making the longi turn out nice because if you fuck up this part then your longi will not look nice you know uh, what, what you gotta do is see I have a very nice triangle over here and this is how it's supposed to look like you know if it, it's not it's, it's not looking like this so if it's like cooking like this you gotta redo it like make sure you have a nice you know shape here at this step and once you're at this step what you gotta do is see it's, this is very difficult to explain there's like two parts you have to fold like here there's one part here that's the you know the left side and this is the, there's another part here right here and what you gotta do is you, you pull this you know part here and then you push it down to your you know waist and this you know the leftover part and this the left side part you pull it and this leftover part you twist it in see you twist you're twisting this like that and you just you know shoving it in and there goes your laundry see looks pretty nice right yeah I'll show you one more time this is very difficult and I don't know my vocabulary is not helping me you know explain good so you just got you guys just gotta watch them you know all right so I'll show you one more time the right side, fold it in. This is the difficult part. You just, you just, you just gotta practice them, you know, until you get it right, like that. And then the left side, use your, hold it with your arm, and then left side like that, and make sure it's looking nice. Now you pull them down, pull them down to your waist, and then this leftover part and this left side part, you pull them in, and there you go. And it's you know we really you know there now you know it's not gonna come off, come off that easy you know, once you do it really tight. So that's how you wear longi. But I'll, I'll give you some advice what I do to you know make my look my longi look nicer. So I'm a short guy you know I'm like five six and this you know longi is actually a little bit too long for me. And I don't think Burmese people do it, but what I do is I actually fold it in like this, like maybe like. Three, four inches, I fold them in so it's like not too long in the first step. Then I do the same thing, you know, same thing right like this, and then like that. 
the same, right? But when I'm pulling it down, I, it's like folded in here, so I can just, you know, go like this, and I don't have to be like going like that, you know? I can just unfold the, you know, the folded part, and then you have the leftover part here, like that, same thing. And then just pull them in, and the same thing like that. Yeah, that's how I do it. And another advice for you guys, another advice, this is, I think this is very common advice people give, is when you fold, fold, and when you're about, you know, tighten this up, you should definitely, you know, exhale your air, you know, your stomach, like that. You know, you pull up, your, you, you make your stomach, you know, like, breathe in, breathe out, so, and then you tighten them up. So when you're like in your normal state, it automatically becomes, you know, tight, man. You understand me? Yeah? So that's about it, man. That's, that's how you do your laundry, you know? It is very difficult, you know, when you do them in, at like, you're, when you're like a beginner. But people get used to it. Like, I'm very good at it now, I believe. All right, so yeah. That's the law, how to wear the laundry part. I'll give you, uh, let's get into the what, uh, question and answer part, you know, I've been receiving a lot of, you know, questions when I wear, like, from the visitors, like that, so, yeah, I'll give you, like, I'll answer, like, some of the most common questions I've been receiving. Question number one, do people wear underwear beneath the laundry? Well, I do, you know, I do, but I don't know about everybody else, you know, I don't know what's right, but I do. Let's have this question answered by my viewers you know you guys know better than me right do you wear underwear beneath your laundry comment please question number two are there like a size to it i believe not you know like everywhere i've seen they only have like a single size like yeah I, i'm pretty sure there's no size but i don't know man yeah this is the question for all my viewers burmese viewers Help me answer this one too, you know? Are they like the size? What, what, what do the fat people do, you know? They wouldn't have enough to, you know, like, go like that, right? Question number three. Does laundry fall loose easily? Yeah, if you suck at it. And question number four. This is like the most frequently asked questions. What do you do when you go toilet? You know, when you take shit, what do you do with it? How do you do? You know, I'll show it to you guys. All right, so let's just imagine this is the toilet seat, you know? You know, okay, you, you're like, you know, you're coming in, and uh, unfortunately, you know, most of the, you know, toilet in Myanmar, the floor is like wet, usually, you know, it's usually wet. So what I don't want to do is, I don't want to be like taking off my laundry like this, because it's gonna get all wet down here, right? So what I do is, I'll, you know, I have my laundry on and when I take off, I'll be going like that. I'll be going like that. And this laundry, you know, usually there's like a hook on the door, right? For your bags and stuff. I'll just hook them over there. Yeah. And then, yeah, I do my thing. I do my thing. And when I, when I wear it, I just do the same thing reverse ways. Like that, I wear it like that from the top. So it doesn't get wet on the bottom, man. Yeah? And just wear them. Yeah, simple as that. I don't know how you guys wear them. Like, I, I'm sure there's like different style people do. So yeah, let me know if you do like some other way, okay? So that was my question and answer part, guys. Let's get into the do's and don'ts when wearing laundry. Do wear sandals together with your laundry, man. Not just shoes, because shoes will not match with laundry. Simple as that, okay? Do not fix your laundry in front of people, especially ladies. You know, there will be times where your laundry becomes loose and you have to fix them, but you know, do not fix it in front of people, or at least try not to. And when you must have to, you know, you face away, you know, face away and do them, you know, that's some respect, you know, and then do them, you know. Nobody want to see you, you know, tightening up your laundry, guys. Do always keep in mind that you are wearing laundry, especially you're like a beginner laundry wearer, you know? You know, sometimes it will like 
be like loose and like fall off without you noticing it and you don't want to be like this guy in the picture man and lastly this is the I guess most important part of the video this is like a very important precaution for all of you guys okay do not do not you know do not use your longi as a superline cave and try to fly off with it because you look stupid man okay all right so that's gonna be it for my video guys thank you very much for watching press the like subscribe and i'll see you in the next video